In the beginning, we were foolish, in the dark, ignorant. As the progression of the earth and mankind rushed forward, however, we developed ourselves as one of the most intricate and advanced societies on this planet. Looking back, we thought we were wrong. To be honest, a long time ago we were wrong with a lot of things, but there's one thing that we were wrong in thinking we were wrong in the first place. Planet Earth is home of approximately 8 jillion species in the animal kingdom. Each of these organisms roam this world with vast knowledge of their surroundings. However, there is one detail that was previously accepted that we do not know about our world today. It's time to lay a flat to you. The Earth isn't round. Today we ask two strong advocates of the theory of flattivity to let us explore their vast knowledge over the matter. Secular scientists of the 17th century strongly noted that the Earth was flat. It later became public knowledge that the Earth was round. However, facts and theories right now suggest that the Earth is indeed flat and you're just being lied to. You're known for having your own type of theory of flattivity, but uh, I want to know what, what it entails. Well, my theory is with the flat earth is very similar to like a piece of paper. It's completely flat on both sides. On one side, you got the northern hemisphere. On the other side, you got the southern hemisphere. There's a reason the equator is so hot. And it's because it is the edge. It is the edge. If you were to drill directly down from Ohio, you'd probably end up in China. I see. Now, the reason People always wonder how yeah. long will it take to drill the center of the earth. Mm. The reason we don't know exactly how long that is or yeah. how much time is because there is no center of the earth. Oh. If you tried that, you would just go directly to the other side. It'd probably fall off into space and die. You ever seen the movie Gravity? Just like that. So on the other end of the spectrum, I want to know your thoughts on people who believe that the earth is round and their theories. Have you seen the earth? Does this look round to you? I mean, beside the pond, but like everything around it. This is the ground is flat. Is there anything new in the world of flattivity that uh, is being recently discovered? No. <laughs> I'm have to ask you to leave. Please leave. Like where? Go. So how long have you been interested in this? Um, I'd have to say for the past year two around around a year or two uh so uh tell me how did you get interested in it um what has got me into believing that the earth is flat is that it's just my son thinks the earth is a basketball and i want to disprove him on that the world is actually flat and not a basketball so I'd like to ask you, um, what are your thoughts on other theories of flattivity? The thing about the other theories is they're loosely based off of the fact that you can fall off the edge of the earth or something like that, and then that's 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 all it is. Like the Bermuda Triangle, a lot believe a lot of people believe that that's the edge of the earth, and that that's where people go is they fall off the edge of the earth through that. Like if you drill through the earth, that you're gonna go to China. You're not getting to China. You're going through, and you're not coming back. That's why it's like, you can't figure out how deep you can go, because the people who have gone that deep have not come back. They, they haven't come back. The earth is round. I don't know, I wanna know why that's not true. The, <laughs> the earth isn't round because of two, two key things. That when you look out, like I know when people say, when you look into the sea, it's curved. There's a, there's a, there's a other side that you can keep going like that. That's just your eyes playing a trick on you. Eyes can do some weird things, right? So no, you, that's not true. The Earth, like it's flat. You and me standing here are not curved, right? We're standing flat. And I know you're gonna say it's the scale. It's because it's too big. No, we would feel a little bit of a curve. I feel like. Second, is because, honestly, the U.S. government. I think has a big part to do with it because conspiracy theories with JFK's time and everything and Ronald Reagan. So what are your thoughts on the moon landing? The moon landing? That's a joke. That was green screen. 
completely. There's no way that we went to the moon. We're flat Earth. Why is that? Why is that? Because we don't have a moon. All right, dude, get out. Firstly, the general consensus on the theory of flativity is that the Earth is very much congruous to a chocolate chunk cookie. Now, whether or not it's all on one side or the other, that's debatable. Now, here's an issue that needs some tackling. Earth's movement through space. Well, we know by the round Earth theories that indeed the Earth is on an axis that is tilted. The explanation of the Earth continuously spinning and being at a constant 23.5 degrees is pretty much the wackiest thing I've ever heard. Simply put, the Earth is not spinning, nor is it tilted. If it were spinning, we would not be able to walk upright, as it is purported that the Earth is rotating at 1000 miles per hour at the Earth's equator by round Earth followers. This also eliminates the theory that the Sun is the center of the solar system and that the other planets the system consists of revolve around it. Again, we would feel the force of Earth traveling at 67,000 miles per hour around the Sun in an ellipse-like orbit. It is evident that the Sun is constantly moving just by looking in the sky, thus we are the center of the solar system. As you can see, the theory of relativity is very, very flexible. But what matters most is that they know that the Earth is flat, unlike most of you. Which makes them the top 1% of the population in terms of IQ. So in conclusion today, we learned a lot of facts about the Earth. We learned that it is indeed flat and it is the center of the solar system. Trust me, I'm a credible source. Thank you for watching.